Hello and welcome to DP and T with JD. I'm just going to do two quick unbaggings today. One I've been waiting on for uh, some time considering it was shipped from the US. It's been about two weeks. This is not the seller's fault at all. It was shipped from my own state. I thought I would get it really, really quickly. I was so excited. And then it took a 12 day trip from Georgia to Florida and from Florida back up to the sorting center in Atlanta and finally it arrived in my mailbox today so I am excited to finally get it and we'll see what it looks like. Um, this one is from a store called Diamond Painting Outlet and they're a US seller. They do have low stock during this time but they have some paintings in and they do custom so I ordered a custom from them that I'm still waiting on because it takes them uh, about a month to set it up and get it out. Um, so we'll see what this one looks like since I've been waiting so long. I hope it's really awesome. So it's on a nice foam roller, a big fat foam roller, um, so it doesn't get squished. Um, and already you can see the tool kit has a nice, um, the standard diamond painting pen, but it does have a three place here, which a lot of mine have not come with that. And I lost mine down the couch the other day in a place that is unreachable, so that was fun. Um, nice squishy, so this is um, a step up from the, the standard basic toolkit, but still pretty basic, but useful. It's shrink wrap, and I can already see there's a huge um, inventory list with it. Printed for those who can't see well. They just cut into a bag of diamonds. This is wrapped really tightly. So I'm having a hard time getting into it. Alright. That and now it is all taped together so it doesn't flop about, I guess. This is um, just a 30 by 40 and it's taped again. Yeah. There we go. Um, it's pretty nice. I'm happy with the resolution for a 30 by 40. I was a bit worried because it's a bit um, detailed, but overall it looks pretty good and I am happy to do this one and hang it up. Um, the symbols look pretty clear. There's a small symbol guide over here, but they have a large print one there. Um, and it has DMC colors listed, so I'm very happy with the quality of that. Um, the canvas feels nice. It doesn't fray at the edge. It's not soft and lovely on the back, but it's sturdy. Um, and it looks like pork glue. Yeah, this is pork glue. It's very sticky, so that's quite good. So I'm excited to do this one. I'm going to hang it in our dining room and it will look beautiful there. Look. But the diamonds are all in baggies so um, it's kind of nice if you didn't want to get out there in these nice bags. Um, there's so many colors though I'm definitely getting up. Okay, everything is taped together. So it is nice and secure. That out of the way. A nice, big, easy to read <laughs> uh, key here. We have one, two, three, four, four five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. 1, 30 colors in total. Uh, that sounds pretty good for this. Um, it looks fairly confetti-ish, which I'm okay with. And I have a new square drill that I'll be trying out on square drill. I have a two square ruler I'll be trying out 
um, with this painting to see if it uh, speeds me up any and hopefully we'll get a video out on that. Um, the drills look good. It's an escapee in that one. I don't see a lot of knobs um, or holes right away. It's terrible lighting this morning because it's really um, cloudy out. It's a nice buttery yellow, 745. 3799, a dark gray. 3822. 152. Oh, 159, that's a pretty light blue. A little light PT Terracotta 402. 3689. 161, 648, 500, that's interesting, it looks black, but maybe it's really dark green. I really like this color, <clears throat> kind of a seafoam green, very pretty, 523, 712, well, that's a pretty crimson, 816, 535, 3752, 823, 838, 902, 3835, 389, uh, pretty green, 3363, 3863, 3721, kind of a dusty crimson, 3750, 921, 931, 939, 976, 3328, and 434. Uh, no 310s, wow, but we do have a little bit of 939. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, that's 30 colors. So, I'm excited to start this one. I'm almost finished with the one I'm working on, and this will probably be the one I work on next. So, let me clear this away, and we will look at the other one that I did not expect to receive today. Okay, this one I ordered from Diamond Painting Gifts. Um, I took a peek because I didn't even know who this was from. I had a couple that I knew I had three paintings from, so I had to look. And the one I peeked in is this one. This is actually going to be a gift. Um, the whole kit is going to be a gift for my cousin's wife. She's really into puzzles, and I thought she would enjoy diamond painting as well. Um, they're very social, and they can't be social very much right now. They love to travel. They go to Disney World. They go on cruises. They go to the beach and to Mexico. So I thought she would enjoy this one. It doesn't say what size it is. I think it's supposed to be a 30 by 40. Let me get my measuring tape really quick and measure it. We have a very basic kit. I've got some extra squishies coming in, so I'll probably throw one in there for her when they come. Okay, this is not so flat. Mm, I think it's poor blue. Um, not seeing any rivers. No, there's just imprints from the plastic being crinkled, so no rivers, which is good, but also not wanting to lay flat. Okay, so this is inches, here we go, centimeters, and this is um, not quite 25 by not quite 35, so I think this was supposed to be a 30 by 40. And the canvas itself is a little over 30 and right at 40, so the drill field is not that. So, Diamond Painting Gifts, their sizes list the canvas size, so I'm slightly disappointed by that because I think there would be better resolution in detail if this was actually 30 by 40. But um, 
It's a, her first time diamond painting, so I think this will still be a good project. The drill field is clear. Um, it's 27 colors, which is pretty good. So um, I'm still going to give her this, but I do wish it was slightly bigger. I wish it would be consistent in how they measured it. There, got the drills. Some nice colors. And... They are not listing DMC colors. No, these are DMC colors. Okay. We have some really pretty purples up front. Uh, 154, 208, 316, 550. I like that one. I have to remember that one. 720, so we go orange for the fireworks. 741. Let's show this side, maybe. You see all the colors. I can read them upside down. 741, 743, 775, 791. It looks really dark, but I think it's a dark blue. Um, 792, 796, a lot of blue going on in here. 799, 814, 820. Wow, this is, this is a big chunk of the blue. Here, eight, another 820, two 820, 919, 939, not a surprise, 995, two of those, and 996. Then we get to the 3306, then we have 3354, some nice pinks to highlight those fireworks, uh, 3713. 3755, five. we're getting a lot of next door neighbors coming on over here. 3756, 3761, 3766, 3834, 3842. Oh, that's a nice dark blue, I really like that one. And 3843, so 27 colors, a couple of bags of some of them. So um, overall, the quality looks good. There's a little bit of dimpling on some of them, but I don't see a lot of extra plastic. Um, I don't see a lot of holes right off the bat. And um, most of the bottoms are flat, the majority. So they look, they look pretty good. So I'm excited to give this to her for her birthday in July, I think. But I might give it to her early because she's bored at yeah. home. Get everyone addicted to diamond painting. Okay, let's see. One of these is for me, and one is a little gift to do for my aunt. Okay, so these are standard canvases. They feel okay, they're thick, they're not fraying too much. Ah, the poppies. Standard. Um, same, I think these are all the same size. I really hope the next one isn't. Oh, it says it here, 30 by 40. Um, I like these poppies and I think they'll look pretty good in kind of an impressionist way. Yep, almost 25. Bye bye. Ooh, over, over, almost 35. So, 34 and a half. Anyway. So, again, the size of the canvas is 30 by 40, not the size of the drill field, but this one I think will look good with, a, with that kind of softened impressionist look that we'll get with this kind of resolution. Um, drills look good, 20 colors with this one, not as many, but it's, it's a softer palette, it's not as colorful, so I'm happy with that. I'm not going to take all these drills out right now, but there are no DMC colors on these. They just say one, two, three. So that is interesting. All right, the last one I'm excited about, but also disappointing because I think it's going to be smaller than I want. The live and learn. Um, I think these were like six or seven bucks a piece. It wasn't a lot. 
I have to go back and look in my order for a standard drill on a diamond painting kit. <laughs> nice colors, but again, no DMC numbers. Just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right. 40 by 30. So, um, looking at this canvas, I think it'll be nice. I do wish it was a little more detailed. That's my bad. I should check if they're listing the canvas size or the drill field size, but sometimes they don't really tell you. It has 26 colors. Um, it's clearly marked. I really like this one. It has a huge symbol key on the side, so I'm not going to have a hard time seeing that one. Um, this I'll probably do and put my craft room where I store costumes. This is a little over 25. Bye. A little over 35. So, slightly bigger for this one. I really like this print. Um, I looked up the artist and I'll have to add that into the put a link to the artist because um, they don't tell you the artist and I thought this was like an older kind of vintage piece but when I looked up the image it's definitely by a modern artist so I feel bad sorry but I will put her name up um, she does a lot of fantasy anime work too so uh, she does some really cool stuff and she's also a calligrapher um, but definitely look her up from the link and that is all for today. I'm excited to get these in. Um, so I have plenty to work on because I'm just about finished up with my other one. And I will do a video on the square ruler soon. So take care and keep on sparkling all you sparklers.